Cardinal in a nutshell, we do primarily shower doors. Uh, however, we do get into a lot of intricate uh, stair panels and pretty much if you can dream it or come up with it, we can pretty much put it in glass. CMS uh, had approached Cardinal about a new vertical machine that supposedly had worked out all the kinks in the verticality of the machine. The primary reason that we looked at the Vertex was simply the time savings on fabricating a piece of glass. The process of the Vertex is simple as the, the carts roll over with the glass on it, stacked on it. We essentially have an operator that uh, usually goes through the carts, pulls all the orders, paperwork off of the cart, and at that time they simply go through the software and uh, do a few minor tweakings. They transmit the file to the actual Vertex, and at that point, uh, after they get four or five programmed, they can start loading the machine, and then the, the cycle is pretty much repetitive from that point. Uh, after we get it up and going, the process doesn't stop. Basically, you're looking at uh, two spindles. You're looking at a spindle forward and a spindle reverse on the back side of the machine. Both sides have a tool crib that have eight uh, different tools that go in each head. We do have that capability of drilling holes front and back. So when you're looking at these machines, you're gonna see the drill front head move forward. It's gonna drill halfway through the material. Then you're gonna see the reverse head come in halfway in the material. And at that point, your slug, the glass, leftover access material is gonna fall in the tray below. There's a unique function in the vertex that um, it, it's essentially a halo. Basically what it is, it's, it's, the, it's the surrounding circle that encompasses the tools on both sides. Uh, it, it does have water, so basically when the machine is running, the halo is constantly shooting water frontwards and backwards, and it acts as a cushion to help the glass from being scratched. That's probably one of the most important aspects of the Vertex is the fact that your remake level has decreased and your volume has increased. On average, we're getting a door every six minutes. It's roughly 50 doors per shift, uh, so we're looking at 150 doors per day in a 24-hour cycle. I have a really good relationship with CMS. They are the guys I go to when the machine hiccups. Uh, all of their guys that they send on site to install, basically we have one-on-one -on -one conversations all the time. They're really good about letting us, no matter what time of day, no matter what need, no matter where they are, call and uh, ask questions and give us advice and help. I would recommend the Vertec over a horizontal machine. Uh, we have several juniors on the floor, but uh, due to the verticality and the way that shower doors are made with the hose and so on and so forth, everybody wants the most out of the time that they can potentially get. Everybody wants to get the most bang for their buck. Everybody wants to utilize every second of every day to try to maximize their yield on product. We see a huge benefit with the Vertec it, it's really knocked our stuff up probably 25% on volume. It's an awesome, awesome asset.